fucked right. up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Isn't that so funny, There's though, not a part that he of you fucked that us up, basically? He, he fucked definitely Vegas. pushed him hold harder. Hold yeah, listen, for sure. Let's listen to him. What, what did you say? There's not a part of you that respected the Conor McGregor How in me. How dare you <laughs> compare yourself to hold one on. of the greatest you know, mixed martial arts you know, fighters of all time who has the support of the entire nation of you know, Ireland. You know Conor McGregor you know how many people looks are at me Ireland? and you and can over explore 50, with me than he you. <laughs> Whoever the fuck is in Ireland. What, what, what are the Connor numbers? would love Bert. Connor <laughs> would fucking... If you said Connor... You got one hour to party with one guy. Hang out with one guy. He's picking oh. me, bro. Well, I talk shit. I talk shit. He might ask shit. me advice. I, I, am, I would like to talk to him about his future. I have some thoughts. Yeah, I want him on your podcast so yeah. bad, man. I love that. Why hasn't he been on your podcast? Guy. I don't know. We were supposed to do it a long time ago. I had his trainer on really recently. You know, I, I hope he doesn't think that in any way that I, I don't respect him or appreciate him because fighters are like super super sensitive like i've gone yeah. through that a few times like i called tony ferguson who's like one of my all-time favorite literally yeah. one of my all-time favorite fighters i said he was a brilliant weirdo because he wears like ankle weights the he way got he, mad at you? he got mad at me he wow. got upset and i had to talk to him and i had to, like try to sort it out I, I did it through someone else and I was like, oh, what fuck. pussies they I was all like, are? No, no, the no, 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 no. <laughs> it seems like that. It seems like that. But what it is is you're, you're so exposed. It's you, what you're doing is so personal. It's so insane that you like what we can brush off. It's way harder for them. It, what, you, if you lose a fight and someone disrespects you or they they in public sentiment keeps you from getting a title shot like that's yeah. that's a significant part of their life oh, and they're not used to dealing with public reaction yeah what they're used to dealing with this competition right so the public reaction thing of yeah. celebrity is an afterthought it's something an after effect of competition right you become successful and then you have to deal with all these people around you that want you to dance well conor mcgregor is a natural shit talker thank you he's a great fighter <laughs> but he's also a natural shit talker you want a buffalo bar yeah Dude, that's what I love about Conor McGregor. So why have you had Conor McGregor and Bernie Sanders on? That's it's a, a weird situation that you haven't had either one of those people on. I tried to get Bernie recently. He Somebody, said no? Some fake Bernie contacted us. Oh, you said you got you were had, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was had. They got me. And I said, I'm a big fan. I, I like a lot of your ideas. I'd love to have you on. And then it was Why a would you not Bernie. come on here, though? I don't think he wants to run for president, man. But why would he still not come but on I here to show his ideas? I don't know, man. You know what I fucking love, by the way, about Conor McGregor? Too is that he made, he made me reappreciate the athlete who knows they're also an entertainer. Yeah. yeah. Like, I actually... Yeah. Thank you. You know, there's there's people that did that. Like, I mean, everyone would probably give Ali thing. credit for being... Do you know being, why it works? I don't know why, why? it works. Because, I mean, it's because that's who he is. That's who oh, he is, right. That guy okay. would be talking shit and sparring. Right. There's guys that are just funny that like that. That doc on man. him is fantastic. You look at him smoking weed yeah. with Mike Tyson. By the way, Mike Tyson owns a goddamn... Weed farm. What is it is called it really? now? Yeah. What is it called? Wow. Jamie, make that smaller, please, so we could read what the hashtag is. Um, it used to have. God damn. It used to say something about Tyson something or another. Did they edit it?